Hey guys, what's up? It's Destiny, aka The Goonies. I'm sorry. That's rude. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's Destiny, aka The Goonies. And today, 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 what's the date? I don't know. I'm super duper excited, even though you probably can't tell. What was that? Because I got roller skates and we're gonna unbox them on camera together. If you're here from my Instagram, then you probably know that I've been fiending for roller skates for like the past two weeks. Like fiending on my story every day, like roller skates, roller skates, roller skates. By the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, my Instagram name is The Goonies. And um, that's where I post all my stories like that I'm gonna be dropping a video. So make sure you follow me there, okay? We can be friends. So yeah, let's just get into a little bit of the backstory on my quest for these skates. It wasn't easy. I'ma just say it wasn't easy. No, I'm just kidding. It really was kind of easy, but kind of wasn't. So one day I woke up and I was like, I want roller skates. I thought that it was the greatest idea in the world, that I was the only person who had this idea to get roller skates during quarantine and start skating, but I wasn't. Mm -mm. No, I wasn't. I thought I was, but I wasn't. Everyone was on the same wave as me because skates were sold out everywhere. I called Big Five, Dick's Sporting Goods, um, my local skate shops, sold out everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Well, ultimately, I knew that I did not want to order skates from Amazon. No, I'm not the best at skating, but I do know how to roller skate, and I definitely did not want any cheap skates. So for me, it was between Impala skates and Moxie skates. Impala skate is on the cheaper side, but from what I heard, it's still a good skate. I've been seeing reviews on it, and it's a good skate up until like three months, and then the heel starts coming detached. Like what? Moxie skate is expensive, obviously, because it's a better skate. If I like skating so much, and I actually want to skate, I will invest in some Moxie, but I got Impala skates. So keep in mind, both skate companies were out of stock like of every skate, and they were still in production, and they were both saying like they don't know when they're gonna restock, and it could take eight to 10 weeks, and I was like, hmm, <laughs> no. So I started looking on Mercari, and I found some Impala skates for 220 when they usually go for a hundred that's a lot <laughs> but like I said I was fiending for some skates so I just ordered it um, super duper impulsively I'm still happy about it and I can't wait to open them so I ordered those skates at midnight and the next day <laughs> the next day guess who restocks Yes, and Paula skates. <laughs> the moral of the story is, the moral of the video is, patience is key. Because I spent a hundred more dollars on skates when I could have just waited one more day. <laughs> but I didn't have the patience, young Padawan. So take my word for it. Patience is key, but is it really key because I still got the skates? Let's open them. Even though I didn't wait, I still got a good deal because everything's still in the box. They're brand new. Obviously, they got it from Zoomies, and that's another place that carries these skates just when they restock, so you know. Oh, oh my gosh. The box is really cute. Let me show you guys this box though. Okay. So yeah, that's the box. How do I open it? Mm. 
No, seriously, I don't want to do this box. I don't want to destroy it. Just kidding. <laughs> wow. Patience is key. I just struggled to open this box, and if I would just relax, just a little. And I hope they fit. Like that's that's what's really important. They have a weird smell. really just wanted some like plain black ones or I don't know I didn't want any white ones because I knew like I hopefully I'm not falling or you know but these were the only ones that were available on Mercari for a good price there were some people selling these for like 290 like 350 I, I was like you know they definitely jacked the price up because everyone was sold out but just look at these these are a size 7. I really hope they fit. They have a size guide on their website. And I just took the time to measure my foot because you don't want to be skating in roller skates that are too small or too big. It's just uncomfortable. And I don't know how to lace them either. So I'm going to lace these and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to tell you how they feel on and then we're going to go skate. <laughs> my car super fast because I felt like I was about to pass out which I think means that it was a good workout I think the skates fit comfortably I like them a lot I definitely have to break them in it is a stiff boot so hopefully I can break that in a little bit more I noticed that I just like to skate fast I, obviously I want to learn tricks and how to do spins and stuff but I was just around the tennis court like can't catch me I guess I'm still a beginner skater, but I can skate like I didn't fall once, so yeah. Um, I used to skate in Los Angeles at World on Wheels in my backyard like growing up, so I've definitely been skating. I just want to learn how to like dance on skates and get more like flowy. Thanks for watching my video. If you want to keep up with me skating, then make sure you subscribe and follow me on Instagram. That's it. Bye.